It's hard to believe x play has been around long enough to go through four sets, but it's the truth. Time to take a walk down memory lane and look back at our ever-changing televised terrarium. All right, this is our very first set. You notice we come off the, the TV in the beginning? It's a CRT. Yeah, Wait. I know. Wait. But I think that was typical back then. No, it was. But you see a couple plasmas in the back, but they were really expensive. And also, like, I love in the beginning where we come walking out from nowhere. So. Now, as you can also tell, that was not a set designed solely. Actually, it was not designed for X-Play. No. That's where they shot Tech Live. We're trying to pretend that it's not somebody else's set, so we had to lower the lights way down. Also reflecting the fact that we shot this at like 10 o'clock at night. Hello and welcome to X-Play. Here's the famous black and white camera. Yeah, the black and white, because... Because we didn't invent it. I think we were about a few years behind on the use of it, but what was ever its purpose for anyone? The black and white and the shaky cam. It was supposed to make it look more frenetic because there was a shot here and then there was a shot to the side and one was in black and white and it's crazy. But is Matt Damon going to hit me in the throat? I, I just don't understand. Alright, this is our second set. It was an actual set that was made for us. Now, there's also the bar. We had a bar. We had a bar. Did we have any alcohol? No, we did not. Did we have a coffee mug? Our coffee table? That was pretty sick. I'm so glad you're able to join us today. There's also that arcade cabinet back there. Now, yes. if memory serves me right, that arcade cabinet dates back to 1998 in GameSpot TV. We had that thing forever. The original game in it was Rival Schools from Capcom. Remember it? No, you don't. It sucked. Then there's the third set, or something called The Void. It, it is really dark. All of a sudden, we're back in the dark. And we were in these tiny little pools of light. Tiny. That you could not deviate from, otherwise you were in complete blackness. And then there was the giant globe in the background. When it was delivered, nobody had actually measured the door in comparison to the globe. And yes. so it actually did not fit through the door, and they had to take it apart. And you can see all the little balls on the floor there. Now, yes. Now, people might think, oh, well, you must have had something to hold those balls down there on the floor. No, no, no. Also, there's the game reviewing thingy. That was, I think, our most dangerous set. So this is actually our current set. For some reason, they must like us more now because they have lit it for us. Yes. It's really great. Actually, if, if, you know, John Tess showed up, it wouldn't be terribly surprising. We'll be right back. Best set ever.